So white light falling on two long narrow strips slits and merges and is observed on a distant screen. Red light with that wavelength in the first order fringe overlaps violet in the second order fringe. Um, what's the uh, violet's wavelength? Okay, uh, so when the red light in the first order fringe, that's m equals 1, overlaps violet in the second order fringe, uh, uh, over, so that means the fringe width of red light, so the fringe width of red light is actually twice that is actually twice that let me take this a little bit to the left equal twice that fringe width in the violet light fringe width with violet Okay, uh, so what's the fringe width of a red light? Let's just call that uh, Let's just call that delta y uh, For red r equals to delta y violet z Okay, now I've recorded previous videos where I derived this formula, but in this video I'll just go ahead and do it without derivation. You can look at previous questions. It's a fairly straightforward couple of steps from triangles. It's not hard at all. Uh, delta y, this is for the double slit experiment. So that's the change in the width or the fringe width or the change in the, um, the location of the fringe on the screen uh, is equal to s, which is how far the screen is from the uh, source times the wavelength of the light falling on the screen or emitted from the source divided by a which is the distance between the two fringes uh, sorry the distance between the two slits okay and uh, uh, so uh, plug this up here for each one of these um, and so we get uh, <coughs> uh, if we do that uh, we get for red s lambda for red divided by a has to equal uh, 2 s now the s the distance will be the same because you know they're at the same location and also the distance between the two slits will be the same regardless of what color we have the only difference will be in the wavelength so that's uh, v and uh, we can cross these out so straightforward problem we're looking for lambda v so that's, uh, oh, sorry, we're looking for lambda red. Yeah, what's the question I'm looking for? Uh, uh, we're looking for uh, what's the uh, latter's latter's wavelength? Uh, that's the violet. So uh, lambda violet will equal uh, lambda red over 2. So it's, you know, the, the ratio of the uh, uh, fringe widths is proportional to the ratio of the wavelength. Um, and so we got uh, 700 and, how much was it? 780 times 10 to the minus 9 divided by 2. And if you do the math, um, this will be 390 nanometers or I could just remove this and leave it in nanometers so that's it that does it